Number 10 Panda House. Look through the Sichuan menu, even though the Mian menu features some well known Sichuan dishes like the homemade Sichuan cold noodles. Hopefully, you have a Chinese speaking buddy who can assist you, as there is no English equivalent for it. Number 9 Noodle Holics. Place an order for Cha Shoa dumplings if you like pork. Though the dish is straightforward pork wontons in a spicy vinegary oil with scallions, it is masterfully prepared and worthy of your dreams. Number 8 Mian Sichuan. The Chinese word for noodles in this context is Mian. It has nothing to do with Mian sushi and modern Asian cuisine, which closed in June. The restaurant serves Chinese street food delicacies, including beef skewers and fish balls, in addition to a selection of noodle bowls. Number 7 Kung Fu Noodle. Another restaurant with a name that sounds generic but offers unexpectedly authentic food is Kung Fu Noodle. Sichuan dishes are available, but the highlights of the trip should be northern China inspired specialities like the Chinese beef burrito and Jingdong meat pie. Number 6 Jun Dynasty I once spoke with an Uber driver in Midtown who said that many of his customers were Chinese visitors traveling to the Jun Dynasty. That is encouraging. The menu features both Sichuan and American Chinese meals, but you should definitely order the Sichuan delicacies. Number 5 Fat Man Kitchen Fat Man Kitchen, which combines Sichuan and Shanxi cuisines, has emerged as one of the Tucson's most popular new dining establishments. With scallions and bean sprouts, the Xi'an oil splashing noodle dish consists of house-made biang biang noodles that are an arm's length and are drenched in a spicy garlicky chili oil. Number 4. China Shizuan China Shizuan is a restaurant with a somewhat generic name, yet their Sichuan food is excellent. Just be sure to place your Sichuan menu order. Additionally, the moniker water boiled fish is dull and deceptive. Number 3. China Pasta House The owners of China Pasta House are from Dandong, which is a northeastern Chinese city that is situated just over the river from North Korea. Chinese sauerkraut, a specialty of the region, is essentially a mild version of cabbage kimchi. It's typically served with pork over rice or in soup with homemade noodles. Number 2. Chef Wang Chinese Restaurant there is a long selection of regional foods from places like Sichuan, Dongbei, and Xinjiang on the expansive 165-dish menu. Sichuan food is well known for its spicy numbing dishes. Dongbei in the northeast is well known for its soccer crot like pickled cabbage. Number 1. Asian Spice When prepared correctly, Americanized Chinese food can be a relevation, but it can usually comes out sticky and sugary. For an insight into the origins of American Chinese cuisine, seek out cooks with training from Canton, the most significant culinary province in China.